calling it. Disney wins at life. My name's Donette Swan, and if you're a Disney fanatic like myself, then you'll know live action remakes have become pretty big in the last few years. And their latest feature is a tale as old as time. That's right, Disney is taking a crack at Beauty and the Beast. Now in most cases, when Disney decides to do one of these remakes, they tend to make the stories a bit edgier. Characters are modernized, some little tweaks get made to the plot line, and some just get downright dark. Hello? Thank you. But from the trailers I've seen so far, I mean, well, if you've ever seen the 90s version, it's pretty spot on. You can even watch a side-by-side -side comparison of the two, and short of some effects CGI can't even accomplish, there's virtually no difference. From the costumes to the script, I mean, they actually put in the talking teapot and clocks and the giant big furry lion thing. You mean the beast? Nobody asked you. Do you want me to turn the lights off again? But what really got me excited was the newest trailer that aired during the Golden Globes this past Sunday. The 30 second spot used many clips we had already seen in previous trailers, but had one special twist. I want adventure in the great white somewhere. Hello? Yes, we actually got a little snippet of Emma Watson singing one of the iconic songs from the film. Now, whether this is going to be a full-blown musical production, we can't tell from the trailers alone. But either way, I'm pretty stoked to see one of my childhood favorites literally come to life. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below, and while you're at it, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss next week's awesome review. Until then, Johnette.